Our mission is really to bring comfortable dentistry to everyone. And so whatever level of anesthesia that patient needs is, is what we're trying to do. All right, uh, we're here at our uh, No Fear Minute. We're just going to quickly dive into some, uh, some brief topics and uh, get Dr. Sayer's wisdom. Uh, all right, here we go. Great. First things first, um, IV sedation. It's the core of what we do. It's kind of uh, incorporated and integrated into so many of our options, um, but not everyone knows exactly what it is, there is an option for them, so I kind of just want to pass the mic to you and kind of, what is IV sedation all about? Well, our, Claire, our, our mission is really to bring comfortable dentistry to everyone. And so whatever level of anesthesia that patient needs is, is what we're trying to do. And some people are they, you know, just very comfortable coming to the dentist and having their clinics done without any, any uh, anesthesia at all. Others are very comfortable with local anesthesia. But there are so many people from the fearful to uh, physically and medically handicapped to just so many people that need different forms of anesthesia. So we have them all available here. We can use uh, pill sedation, combine that with nitrous oxide. We can use intravenous sedation. And then we can also do general anesthesia as we have anesthesiologists here on staff. They are medical doctors. So we have basically any type of anesthesia option that one would need for a dental procedure. Yes. For any reason that one would need that. Right. And that is an option that anyone can have. Anyone can have, even from an examination. We'll see patients who, for whatever reason, have difficulty even, even opening their mouth. They have so much fear. And so we'll do our examination and cleanings with, with IV sedation or even general anesthesia. So this is not an uncommon thing. We see it all the time. Hmm. All right. I think I'm going to stop. Thanks, Dave. Thank you.